All right, hello. We're back playing some Star Wars Squadrons. Uh, picking up where we left off in the story. So that would be mission four. It's called Secrets and Spies. Captain Teresa Carroll. Carroll? I guess that's how you say that. Has reassigned you to the Empire's Titan Squadron. A spy at the Hosnian Prime. At Hosnian Prime. Has intel about the New Republic's secret initiative, Project Starhawk. Go to Hosnian Prime and extract the spy. All right, all right. Trying to get this thing settled just right so that when I'm moving my head around, it doesn't wiggle too much. An old enemy has finally surfaced. One of my spies has linked the attacks on our Star Destroyer with the New Republic Starhawk project. The common factor is Lyndon Jays. You knew Jays better than anyone, Captain Carroll. If I had, I'd have destroyed him before he betrayed us at Fostar Haven. And this is your second chance. The rebels are keeping a low profile. Take Titan Squadron, hunt down this Starhawk, and eliminate it. Gladly, Admiral Sloan. But if I may ask, there's a particular pilot I'd like to requisition. <laughs> slime taking our ships. Good. More the merrier. <laughs> Easy, Von Reg. Remember the last time you lost your call? The day I cut through a whole squadron of rebels and saved you all neck. Focus. Shen's right. Tighten it up, Sol. And Von Reg. Save a little for the enemy. Overseer to Titan. Finish your inspection. Your new wingmate has arrived. So, you're our new wingmate. Welcome to Titan Squadron. I'm Varko Gray, Squadron Leader. I think they're waiting for you in the briefing room. Better make a good first impression. Okay. Is there anybody else I can talk to in this joint? Better get briefed. Welcome home, pilot. It feels like a lifetime since Fostar Haven, doesn't it? One fool betrays his squadron, and loyal officers like us are reassigned in disgrace. I heard they sent you to the Outer Rim. I got the Merim Sector, protecting fuel shipments from petty scoundrels and pirates. The kind of posting that used to end careers before Endor, before Lyndon Javes reappeared. No doubt you've heard. Admiral Sloan has instructed me to hunt that traitor down and end this Project Starhawk. It seemed fitting that I bring you back to help me destroy Linden. Your Empire needs you, pilot. Are you willing? Good. For now, you will be flying as Titan III. Let's get to work. One of our spies, Agent Thorne, has discovered vital intelligence on Project Starhawk. Your mission is to extract her from an orbital outpost above Hosni and Prime. Your job is to secure the outpost for our extraction team who will arrive aboard the shuttle Gladius. 
Behind enemy lines. You must be precise and swift. We have no room for error, Titan. To gain access, you'll have to eliminate perimeter defenses. Intelligence reports missile platforms defending Hosnian space. Destroy them. The outpost itself is protected by turbo laser cannons on all sides. Evade and eliminate them all. When you've secured the area, you will escort the Gladius to the outpost, and our extraction team will acquire Agent Thorn. Once Thorn is secure, reach your Gozanti cruisers and return to the Overseer. Do not lose our spy under any circumstances. That is all. Now more than ever, the Empire needs reliable soldiers like Agent Thorn. Like you. Unity is the only path to progress. I trust you are aligned with Admiral Sloan's vision for the Empire. We cannot afford to fracture. Not after Endor. This mission is a vital step towards dismantling the Rebellion. And they are a Rebellion. Don't be fooled by their new name. The New Republic will fall, just like the last one. It's time for you to play your part. Get to the hangar. Ready your ship. I'm Rella Sol. No need to introduce yourself. I've already reviewed your service record. It's been a long time since you were on the front lines. In days past, a mission like ours would have been afforded every possible resource. Unfortunately, times are tight since Endor. In one battle, we lost our Emperor and gained a hundred warring factions. If only Emperor Palpatine hadn't dissolved the Imperial Senate. At least then, Senators, like my parents, could have maintained order after Endor. But no. Not that I question the Emperor's decision, of course. But now that he's gone, we must look to the future. And reinstating the Senate would help subdue all of this infighting. We can talk later, perhaps. Ooh, perhaps. <laughs> okay. Just rando stormtroopers standing around in the briefing room. What's up, Waylon? You'll be the new pilot. Sergeant Wade, chief mechanic and head of the hangar crew. Don't see the appeal in flying myself, but I've been working on ties since they rolled off the assembly line. Your fight is in good hands. The Overseer saw some action at Pothor and JL, but it's had a complete inspection and overhaul for this mission. Admiral Sloan's orders. And on my orders, every tie in this hangar has been serviced and test flown. Tighten half the rivets myself. We're ready. Gotta say, I don't know how you and Titan cope out there. No shields or life support, just whole plating between you and space. It must build character. Never met a TIE pilot who backed down from any challenge, shields or not. I've prepared your starfighter to match the latest Imperial guidelines. But if you've got a preferred component or need something customized, I'll take care of it. Just say the word. Your TIE fighter's ready. Good flying. Cool. Von Rig. You're the new arrival. I'm Havina Von Rig. Titan can always use another pilot, so long as you're good at killing rebels. We're going right into their territory, Hosnian Prime. We'll give those scum just a taste of what it was like at Endor. I was there, you know, when the rebellion murdered our emperor. Half my squad died trying to defend him. Captain Carroll understands. She doesn't lecture me about justifiable force like my other commanders. She knows all I need is a target. Politics are for admirals. I keep it simple. Always shoot to kill. Mess with the squadron and you mess with me. But do your job and I'll have your back. Later. <laughs> She's got like the swoop cut. She's grouchy. 
Newcomer. Welcome to Titan. It's the Stig. Call me Shen. Oh, I mean Shen. Before you ask, helmet stays on. Cockpit <laughs> or not. Too many hard landings. Broken neck. Five, six times. Cybernetics keep me going. Fight. Fall. Get up. Fight again. All for the Empire. Advice. <laughs> Don't annoy Von Rack. Good talk. Another time. Wait, so how does this guy eat? The helmet always stays on. So you like get an IV for nourishment? All right. Prepare for launch. The TIE Fighter. Classic. Maneuverable. Flexible. Can't take much direct fire, but that's no problem for a skilled pilot. Your loadout, however, is not standard. And again, neither are any of Titan Squadron's missions. Okay. Mm for our lasers. Oh, let's do the burst fire. That sounds fun. Oh, you pick that? Yeah, buddy. Repair system. Got missiles. Proton torpedo. All right. Keep that proton torpedo in the back pocket. I don't know if we're going to fight capital ships in this battle. We got concussion missile, countermeasures. So we're fighting stationary targets, so I think I want the reinforced hull. Try the twin thrust, that sounds fun. Okie doke, let's launch. Hope I don't die. Head on unless 
you have a death wish. Can't touch it. Keep it up. Who's next? You gotta look up a little bit. That's what I like to see. Those missiles or those lasers just freaking kill things. Oops. Emergency power conversion. Unshielded ships like the TIE Fighter feature an emergency cow power converter. Cower converter. Um, which allows the pilot to instantly convert all power from one system to the other. You can uh, you can temporarily, temporarily drain your engines. It's been a long day. For a surge of power to your primary weapon or drain your weapons to charge your boost dusters. Okay. Hold X to use the power converter. Weapons. Ooh, so I can shoot this thing. Titan three is on their shield generator. Keep it up. Can I go back to? The Jeez. 
Clear here. Finish off the rest. We're with you. Where's he dead? Alright, alright. Everybody was tie fighting. Cats were fast as light. Closing in on you, Titan Squadron. We'll keep you safe, Gladius. Let's get you to the outpost's landing platform. Affirmative, Squadron Leader. We'll be gone before the Rebel fleet even knows we were here.
I should probably be telling my squad next to attack. Yo! How did that thing even get there? Thank you, bro. Is my homie keeps her doing peace playing, whatever. That's the best you got. They got a lock on me. You missed. Take the go after right. that thing. The shuttle gladius team. Regroup with our shuttle now. I'm going. I'm going. Do I need to be a problem? Titan three, regroup at the shuttle. We're clear of the station. Cover our escape and escort 
us to the jump point. Affirmative, Agent Thorne. We have Republic Corvettes inbound. Move, Titan. Ladies, change course and keep Agent Thorne safe. Oh dear. Titan <laughs> I couldn't tell how far away it was. Protect uh. the shuttle at all costs. Destroy those scum. I'm in formation. I'll handle this. Get Agent Thorne back to the overseer. Smash and so grab action. Of the squadron now. How'd I do? So I'm always slow. I can never do it in the time limit or whatever for the efficiency medal. But we didn't die. Uh, we destroyed all remaining fighters before the Gladius. Uh, destroyed the New Republic GR-75s before any escaped. And we completed the mission. So all in all, I'd say it's a success. Thanks for watching this one with me. And uh, I hope you have a good time and see you back for the next one. Later.